One warm and sunny afternoon, a buffalo was eating grass a short distance away from the river bank. Suddenly, he heard a loud cry, Help! Help! Somebody help me! The voice seemed to be coming from the river. The buffalo rushed towards it and was greeted by the sight of a crocodile on the river bank with an enormous log on his back. Help me, Mr. Buffalo. This log fell on my back. I can't move and I am in pain, cried the crocodile. Feeling sorry for the crocodile, the buffalo took a moment to think about how he could help. Of course, he could use his strong horns to lift the log off the crocodile. The log was terribly heavy, but the buffalo heaved with all his might. Suddenly, the log was lifted and the crocodile was free. Thank you, Mr. Buffalo. It was very kind of you to stop and help me. You are welcome. I am happy. I was able to help you. As the buffalo turned to leave, he felt something sharp pierce in his leg. He looked down and saw that the crocodile had bitten one of his legs. What are you doing? cried the buffalo in alarm and confusion. The crocodile responded in a muted voice. I have been stuck under that log all morning, Mr. Buffalo. I am very hungry. I can't help wanting to eat your leg. Just then, a clever mouse deer happened to pass by. He saw the buffalo's leg trapped in the crocodile's mouth and made his way over to them. He asked the buffalo, What had happened? I saved this crocodile's life by removing that log on his back. But now he wants to have me for lunch. I do not believe that Mr. Buffalo has the strength to lift such a big and heavy log. Of course I did. It's the truth. I lifted that log all by myself, replied the buffalo proudly. He is telling the truth, Mr. Mouse Deer, added the crocodile. Okay, then show me, show me, do it again. Show me that you have done this. Then Buffalo gathered up all his strength and bent his horns to lift the heavy log. In a flash, it was on the crocodile's back once more. Oh, I am sorry, I am sorry. The kind Buffalo wanted to relieve the crocodile of his pain. But if I free him, he might want to bite me again, he thought. The crocodile said, I realize I have been ungrateful to you, Mr. Buffalo. I am sorry for what I did. And I promise not to harm you again. Both the mouse deer and the buffalo were convinced of the crocodile's sincerity. The buffalo again used all his strength to lift the log off the crocodile's back. Thank you, Mr. Buffalo. The mouse deer was happy to hear that the crocodile had learned his lesson. So students, this is the story of the clever mouse deer. Hope you have enjoyed this story students. Thank you so much.